local alternative band Hazmat has gained over 57,000 followers on TikTok, with their most popular video having over 2.3 million views. Um, it was really unexpected and crazy. I didn't, you know, expect that it would blow up immediately, but I mean, within like three hours at least, we were getting thousands of views, and it just kept going, um, which was really scary because you get so many comments talking about how you look and how people perceive you, and it's not always right. Uh, so that's scary, but I try and focus on the fact that people are really nice to us most of the time, instead of like the very few people who just have something to say, just because I want to. Guitarist Lily Belknap says that Hazmat is unique from other alternative bands. We're very versatile. I feel like we've all been playing for a long time, so we do everything from like traditional emo to like more indie and like alternative music. And I think there is a lot of like in indie and alternative bands out right now, but I feel like we just have a little bit of a special sound, especially in our covers. Lead singer Sarah Amadine and guitarist Olivia Haley share what they have learned from their success. Kind of like, I guess, being confident and not listening to negative things. Yeah. Like, even though we're not that big, there's like a lot of people that give an opinion. So it would definitely be worse when we got really big. So we just kind of get used to not listening to mm -hmm. this stuff. I think it was just really nice to see that people were tagging their friends like, oh, we should start a band, look at this one. Uh, someone commented on like our second video, like, I just bought a guitar, like, you guys are an inspiration, which was crazy because we're literally just like a bunch of teenage girls in a basement playing music and people think that we're cool, which I didn't expect. Like, I would love to like at least make it a little bit. Even if it's like local, if it's a St. Louis scene, I would love to, you know, Hazmat be like a kind of a name that people people see all the time. I think that'd be crazy. But I think like making a bond while also doing something pretty unique. Like there are not many like teenage female bands out there, especially in St. Louis. So I think it's just really cool that we're all doing something different together. 